Hello people, Genium Police Mati here. Today I'll be showing you how to install a, an ARC bubble to your 3.60 Henkaku enabled PlayStation Vita or PlayStation TV. Now before we start, what is ARC? So ARC allows you to run PSP software, PSP games, PSP ISOs, ISOs homebrew plugins in games I guess. Uh, for the PSP, and yeah, that's about it. It's similar to TNV, but it does not have the XMB. Now, before we start, you're going to need, well, obviously, a PlayStation Vita or Vita TV with 3.60 and a Henkaku. And it would be best if you had a PSP game installed, any PSP game, a PSP demo, a PlayStation Mini game. Um, I'm going to show you what happens if you don't have a game. If you don't have a game, the Arc installer will uh, create a bubble for you, uh, a custom. It will install a custom Mini and install Arc uh, over that. But if you don't have Inkaku enabled, it will not run. It will say you'll have to you have to download from the PlayStation Store. Uh, because, yes, you don't have the proper license, I guess. On the other hand, if you already have a PSP title or a PSP Mini, and you install um, Arc to that, you'll be able to start Arc even without starting Henkaku, and that is a big advantage. Also, if you transfer that over CMA, you can re then restore that to a 3.63 Vita, and you can use uh, ARC there. Of course there are other ways to install ARC directly onto 3.63 but I just wanted to show you this. So yeah, without further ado let's begin. So as you see I have ARC fast installed. You just install that VPK. I'm going to link that down below in the description. It's very simple. You don't need to do anything but that. So just open it up. Make sure you have unsafe homebrew enabled when you install it. So as you see, I don't have any PSP games. So it is going to say, it's going to tell me to press cross to install the mini and then arc. And what what's going to happen is that I will not be able to actually launch arc without Henkaku being enabled. So yeah, just press cross again and it will restart your PS Vita. So as you see I'm restarting my PlayStation TV and the mini will be installed to my PlayStation Vita TV I guess. Anyway, you'll see the Arc bubble, but as I've told you, you can only start Arc by starting Henkaku. So I'm going to show you what happens if you try to install Arc on an existing PSP game. So as you can see now I have the impossible game, I had that a as a CMA backup, so I'm just going to start it again, and this time I will see, uh, I will see it in the Arc Installer menu. So it's the same thing, just press cross, restart the PS Vita, and that's as simple as it gets. And this is the result. I've just restarted my PS TV again, and this time without Henkaku I am able to start Arc, which was, well, our objective. I don't have any PSP titles to show you, but it works. So that was it for today, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button below, subscribe to my channel for more content, and that is it. See ya!